Hi everyone, my name is Kristen, and I, I just want to say I'm sending my love and blessings to all who feel um, drawn to my page um, and to my services. Uh, it's a pleasure to be here to provide you with uh, support for your soul journey. Um, but in terms of my background, I am a spiritual medium. I'm also a medical intuitive, and that has brought me to the journey of also being able to be a guide for the Akashic Records. So the services I can provide to you are very much heart-centered and heart-based. Uh, my journey has led me to engage with spirit and the intelligence that's around us in ways that has opened up uh, mediumship. I'm a trained medium, um, and that means that I can interact with your loved ones who have passed. I can also interact with your guides, um, and certainly at a higher dimension, uh, the record keepers and guides uh, that are overseeing the Akashic Records. Uh, my abilities have also evolved in a way that I'm able to provide medical intuitive readings, and that means I can provide you with some information related to your health and wellness um, and your spiritual um, health and wellness in terms of what's needed for you to evolve, where are the areas you need to focus on. Um, and the record keepers and guides are sort of keen to engage with me around those abilities. I'm also a Reiki master, and so during our session, I like to surround us uh, with an energy of love um, and support uh, and certainly I ask you if that is okay for you um, and and that helps to uplift the session uh, and also to provide you with some extra energy in terms of your ability to shift and heal uh, and accept the messages that are coming from the Acacia record keepers one thing you can expect in a reading is I actually um, interact with you prior to our session uh, because I feel strongly that it's a sort of transformational process for you to develop the questions you'd like to ask your own record keepers. So I provide you with some information before our session so that you can sit in meditation, in nature, listen to your higher self, and really engage with the kinds of questions you need to hear at this moment in your life. Um, questions that might be part of your own individual healing, uh, questions that might help you answer uh, some of the issues that are going on around the world these days. Um, and so that's how we start our interactions. Um, during the session, I will open your records, uh, and I certainly ask your permission to do that. And uh, prior to that, I actually download opening remarks. Uh, because I'm a medium and I engage uh, with spirit directly in terms of automated writing, and this means channeling, the record keepers have asked me to download uh, all opening remarks in written form. And I type that up for you and send it to you afterwards. But when we open our session, you'll hear those opening remarks. Um, and then we'll move into your questions. I ask for you to provide at least six questions. Other questions might come up during the session. Um, and so part of this is I will be channeling the information directly from your record keepers. Sometimes they'll show me images um, and they'll be telling me audio and so that you'll understand I'll be interpreting and I'll be telling you that. When I'm telling you information, I'll be speaking to you directly. When the record keepers ask me to use my medical intuitive abilities or allow one of your loved ones to come through, I'll let you know that that's happening. Um, and then following our session, um, sometimes, you know, there are some tools and guidance that come forward and I can send you an email afterwards uh, with some follow up uh, sort of support that you might need. Well, my belief is that the Akashic Records come calling to you. Um, and the best way I can describe how I arrived here is um, the Sioux Nation, uh, the, the Native Americans in the U.S. have a saying, and that is the longest journey in your lifetime is from your head to your heart. Um, and my journey started about eight years ago when spirit came calling in a very big way after some loss. And this often happens for people. And I think the more that I, I went through my own transformation, the more I opened up to spirit, um, the higher up I went in terms of engaging with guides. Um, and so I think, you know, for most of my life, I've always had, uh, in terms of, of my purpose, my sole purpose, a real sense that I was in service to others. Um, and so what I started to hear from Spirit is the best way to do that is to support others with their Akashic Records readings. And the other abilities can come forward during those sessions. Um, and so that's how the Akashic Records came calling for me.
Thank you so much for listening and I hope you'll join me uh, for a session. I'm really looking forward to being in service to you um, and to providing you with the support that you're looking for. Blessings to you.